Hefner and Jamie Lissau are here, uh, and they're going to be performing tonight and tomorrow at Comedy Doug. at the Carlson. So I, so what? The so, Dougster. <laughs> Doug and Norma. So what? Doug. Doug so, my big fear was Rob Schneider's coming on. I'm thinking, Snoop I thought it'd be Doug. funny if I was in the newsroom making copies, and he came up and said, what Doug. are you doing? And I said, making copies, and he just said, okay, fine, and then walked on. I thought that would be a great bit. But what is the fear that the people have? The mornings with Doug. See? Where is Alexa? Norma. The Normanator. <laughs> Hey. Storm and Norma! How about this Jamie Lissa over Look here? Look at that. Jamie, Hi, Jamie it is Lissow. so good to see you again. It's you you were here see. a while ago, it's but you're back you. home. You were here a while back. ago. I was. I come here once well, a year. Why did you bring me back so soon then? What was the point? <laughs> to sell tickets. Okay, all right. <laughs> How does it feel to be used? <laughs> so you have answered my question. Yes. Uh, iconic bits that you did a long time ago. Yes. You don't mind doing them still. Well, you know what, though? Because they were funny to me then. They're still it's funny. Again, but I mean, like, that one's. Uh, Copy machine guy. I mean, no one, no one remembers that one as much. But oh, but I like, do. Oh, of this, course. There's one that. Well, thank you. But there's some that like. Um, there's one that because I, you know, my old girlfriend Renee Julian, the beautiful family, Julian family. I used to come up here. We used to go to Mama San's, and oh, yeah. she would take me to this place. I don't remember what the place was, but it was like an African antiquity store. Oh, um, was where was it? Downtown Rochester? Yeah. It was called All Day Sunday. Jeez, how did you know that? Because I, I, I know the owner really well. I've been trying to come really up with a well. name for that for years. I okay. know the owner. I, so, I know the <clears> really So I well, went yeah. in there, and I'm in there, and I'm picking up different stuff, and like drums or little things. Yeah. And, and everything everything in there looked like what my brother would use to hide his weed in. <laughs> <laughs> and so I remember taking up like a little oh, drum, no. and I brought it up to the front. I was like, uh, excuse me, where does the weed go in here? <laughs> And then I, I, I went, I was laughing about that, and then Renee was laughing, and then we went back to, um, went back to Saturday Night Live, and I was, this is a great comedy writer named Lou Martin, we started coming doing this bit. And so we had this thing about, like, uh, I played this African antiquities. I said, so what is this? You know, Chris Farley would go, what is this? Uh, that's a Senegalese loot. <laughs> Senegalese, it's, what do you do? What is it? It's used for, for uh, well, the Senegalese, they use it for uh, fertility rituals. It's made from uh, deer wood. You know, they use one every, so only we use it every seven years. Yeah, what, what do you do with it? You put your weed in there. And, so anyway, it was just so was inspired God. by a Rochester woman. Wow. Yes, I gotta tell my friend that her How did you two? But I'm proud of this. Guy here. I was going to say, how the heck that's, did you two that's get That's a lot of, you're well, really Renee, rubbing the shoulder. Renee was, um, uh, passed away, unfortunately. She had cancer, and I was doing a benefit for her young family, and, um, and I love her family, and Valerie, and, um, hmm. and Wow, Buck, so you stay in touch with the, them still? Yeah, and, and Ron, their lovely dad, and, um, so, uh, we're doing benefit, and this guy over here, mm -hmm. I just started getting back into comedy at the time, and this guy opened up for the uh, the show, and thankfully, there was one guy really funny that night, and I was on the side of the stage of the theater listening to this guy, and I was laughing my tail off, and I said, who's this guy? Who's <laughs> it? Who's that? And then uh, we started uh, working together, mm -hmm. yeah. and uh, then um, I just, I said, I gotta steal this guy away from Hollywood. Now, let me just say that, like, all my friends, it's Adam Sandler, David Spade, and Norm MacDonald, uh, all think you're really funny. And, and I'm saying, wow. Norm MacDonald said, hey, that guy's a real comedy fine. <laughs> this is before Norm MacDonald got in trouble recently. <laughs> so well, that's what matters. <laughs> meant even more back but then. But he wow. said, this guy's a, a comedy find, and, and he really is, and I'm really proud of him, and uh, he's doing great. You two great. seem like you're very, like you're good friends. Yeah, he's a good buddy, Rob. He's you got the same hat. How much really the show? He is starting to steal a lot of stuff from me, though. I think yeah. a hat thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The balding, the mm -hmm. whole thing. The sweater's Sorry. next, because I complimented you on your sweater. I use your name when I go to restaurants. <laughs> <laughs> Do you feel he keeps How much of the show was scripted? The show with, with the two of you, the real Rob? We have a pretty good script. First of all, this next season is Jamie and my wife, Patricia. It's funny because... Jamie's such a nice guy. He's like, well, you guys do the show in the morning. And producer says, I'm not even getting up in the morning. Oh, you're going for it. <laughs> but they write the shows together. And I, I, I of course, I make it way better. <laughs> but, um, but they write, and you wrote the, what is the, the season three going to be? Season three? I'm, I'm so tired. But um, <laughs> I, I remember, I remember loving it. Season three is, has a lot to do with your and uh, Patricia's relationship, where you guys oh, hit a bit of a rocky two. point. <gasps> and mine, too. Me and my... <clears throat> Me and my chick. Well, me and my chick broke up at the end yeah. of uh, season two, season but some two crazy stuff happens. You guys put everything out. And then oh, she's character. with a woman after, yes. which is really an interesting thing because uh -huh. then I can make fun of him. Like, uh -huh. it wasn't just he left for another Phillips? guy. 
Mm -hmm. Well, I don't want to go into that, but I'm saying, though, it did. So it's just kind of funny. I went like, so basically, your thing ruined it for, like, every other guy's thing <laughs> yeah. ever. Nice. That was like it. So she anyways. was with you and said, I don't want any of those ever again. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, but we have a great time working at Jamie's a brilliant comic. And I remember, like, my Norm MacDonald, when he's watching, he said, hey, that guy, uh, he's a real... Uh, Comedy, fine there. And, uh, it's too bad he can't help your career. I know. Because that, you that got a real champion though. there. Now he's, uh, no. But, uh, but I'm really proud of him. Jamie's done great. Yes, um, he has. And we're going to perform tonight. Um, and I said, you know, and I always loved Rochester. I said, yeah, let's go back there and do some shows. Let's do it in a club. Mm -hmm. You know, there's a comedy club here. And it's, it's a owned great by, club. <clears throat> it's a great club. A great guy. Mm -hmm. And Jamie, Jamie loves a guy. And uh, I said, okay, let's go there and they'll do it. Because, mm -hmm. you know, the theater, you go in, you get out of there. But we going to do four shows. My Our our partner with my wife, she's actually going to do stand-ups the second oh, nice. time. Oh, really? The second time she's ever done it. She's yeah. great at it. She's great. She killed the first That's time. That's awesome. Yeah. Like 30 Destroyed. seconds. Destroyed. Tonight, 30 two seconds. shows. <clears throat> Tomorrow, two shows. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the show, shows, most of the ones that are sold out. Yeah, the There's late shows. I mean... Just the late shows are sold out or the early ones? Two early shows are sold out, so just the late shows tonight, the late show tomorrow. But come on out, uh, you know. Love to. Doug and Norma. <laughs> come into the, you can come call into me the Norm. late just show. Call me Norm. That's okay. The Normstress. The Normster. <laughs> Still tickets, not getting free tickets. The Normstress. Tonight, come to find out how Jamie hurt his finger. And a great right. comedy find. He's got to make up a better story <laughs> than the real that's one. Right. No, but the thing is, 